Welcome to the top 10 plays of the season. I'm Joey Zacco. Number 10, we have a familiar face here, your slam dunk contest champion with the steal in week eight and then throws it down on the defender with two hands there to finish the fast break. Terrence Gallo kicks off our top plays. Number nine, Charles Alexander of the halfway crooks from week four, gonna catch the pass and throw it down on two defenders who jumped there. That's about the only good moment the halfway crooks had against Lob City, losing to them in that matchup as we get to number eight. And Joe Secator on Lob City here in the semifinals is gonna drive, lose it quick, and then elevates one-handed. And I don't know why the defender jumped there, but there's Secator, your regular season MVP in the semis. Number seven, more Lob City. We have Cody Crawford to Colin Burns off the glass to Secator one-handed. Secator had 24 points in this one, and uh, Lob City would cap off an undefeated season with their eighth title in the Legacy Leagues. Number six, more Terrence Gallo here of All Waves from the quarterfinals. We're going to see his uh, teammate here miss this, and he's there for the tip slam. He gets up so fast, the defender had no chance on that rebound. Terrence Gallo, number six. And number five, back to the halfway crooks. It's gonna be a steal, Jared Hansen. Up ahead to Ethan Austin, no look. Over the shoulder, Devin Devon Pina throws it down. And uh, Ethan Austin would help the crooks to a six and two record and a very good season as they'd get back to the finals. Number four, the regulators who would lose to the halfway crooks in the semis, get some revenge, two-handed poster on the gym rats for Tommy McSparrin and the regulators. Number three, Terrence Gallo again, I promise, the last time he's going to rebound it here. And two hands again. People jump with him and every time puts him on a poster, Terrence Gallo. Number two, more halfway crooks. I know there's a lot of purple in these highlights, but he's going to kick it out for the three. A rare miss by Jared Hansen. The one-handed tip slam. Ethan Austin get up and then tries to find the camera. I love it. Ethan Austin, the one-handed tip slam. Uh, from week eight, number one, Secator here in Lob City led the league in scoring the and one poster. Look at the ref's face, and those are your top ten plays of the season.